My question um, is uh, to your guest. Uh, you know, across the street from the New York Times building, there's a billboard asking you where your paper's coverage is of the over 2,000 architects and engineers who are demanding a new investigation of Building 7's destruction on 9-11, and the overwhelming evidence that pre-planted explosives destroyed it. Um, since this has everything to do with our national security, can you explain what rational and scientific basis your paper has for failing to, fail, to fairly and objectively cover this crucial issue? Uh, Scott, thanks very much for your question. I grew up near Peekskill and uh, grew up around New York. And uh, so uh, trust me, the people who work at the New York Times have uh, as much of a critical interest in what happened on 9-11 uh, as anybody else, because not only are they reporters there, but uh, they live and work uh, within the city. And we've devoted a fairly considerable amount of repertorial time over the past number of years to the question of uh, all of the different theories, conspiracy theories, regular theories, non-conspiracy theories about what happened uh, on that day. And uh, you've heard the huge uh, variety of them. We have not yet found any convincing evidence to suggest that there was a plot there was a plot that the president knew about in advance, which was one of the issues that came up. I was with the president on 9-11 at the school uh, in Florida. I can tell you that uh, he looked pretty shocked by what had happened and, and shell-shocked by what had happened. And we have not found any evidence so far. That doesn't mean there's none there, but we've not found any evidence so far to suggest that the building collapses were caused by anything other than the two airplanes that flew into them. I remember getting a call from the uh, fire department commander telling me that they were not sure they were going to be able to contain the fire. And I said, you know, we've had such terrible loss of life. Maybe the smartest thing to do is, is pull it. Uh, and they made that decision to pull. And then we watched the building collapse.